Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So today we're going to be doing a makeup swap. She has my makeup and I have mine. The only thing that we will won't be doing. She uh, has your makeup and I have mine. <laughs> you have my makeup. We're gonna be swapping makeup routines as well. So she usually starts off with her eyes and I usually start off with my face. So she's gonna go ahead and prime my eyes. I'm gonna be starting off my eyes cause that's what she likes to do first. So let's just dig on in. And I'm just using my handy dandy e.l.f. primer. It's one of my favorites. I'm using the Wet n Wild concealer to prime my eyes. Is there a special look that you always do with these or? Kind of. Um, I can like nail it out in five minutes. Usually what I do afterwards, I put on my contour. Okay. Now we are switching contours as well because she's definitely a couple shades darker than me. So she's gonna use her own. So what are we switched contours, you dingus? Mm -mm. We switched bronzers. That's not. I don't use it for contour. Really? Yeah. I use my bronzer for contour. It's too warm for me. I haven't used this palette yet. I do have it and I do own it, but she brought her own, so don't have to go and dig into mine yet. All right, and we're gonna tap off the brush. Yep. Oh shit. Yeah. You went and pan a little hard. Sorry. No, you're good. <laughs> now, I haven't messed with the Jeffree Star palette, so I can't really tell you a look, but I can tell you what transition shade I'm going to be doing. That's fine. You can leave creative licensing up to me. Yeah. So, in the next video we're going to be doing, it's going to be a new to us makeup product. So, I'm going to be testing out my Jeffree Star palette. And we're going to be doing a wear test, which you guys know. That is like my favorite thing to do is wear tests. I don't know what it is about it. Well, it lets you know that you have a good product. Yeah, and I guess it's more like, I just like taking everyone throughout my day and see what I'm doing. You which, should vlog more then. I should. So after you do your bronzer, I normally like to, well, your contour, which is pretty much the same thing. Yeah. I usually like to go and prime my eyes, which she already did, so that doesn't count. Yep. Yeah. So then I go into my bronzer and I bronze my face. And usually I like to take it into the, my, almost up to my, the apples of my cheeks, but not really. I kind of keep it okay. along like a C right there. I don't bring it down so to my jaw. So you do the C? Yeah. Like half of the three? Yeah. So I'm just really blending everything, at, everything out because I know she likes everything very blended. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you bronze your jaw at all or just? No. Just this. Yep. So after that, I go and put on blush. Okay. And I like to use, I've been really liking the LA Colors one, which is really pretty. And let me know what you think of that blush, because I've been really liking it. Surprisingly, I think it's really pretty. I can't see anything. Well, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I can give you another blush if you can't see anything. No, I think there's like the slightest little bit of difference, but it's like very close to my skin tones. Oh. Well, I think on, like, my skin tone. Mm -hmm. See, there, I can see it a little bit. Mm -hmm. I just have to, like, pat and pull. I actually go and take a little bit of bronzer and a little bit of blush, and I kind of mix them on my cheeks. This is a lot of work. Yeah. This is an everyday routine, too. I'll use this shade. I'll set my entire lid. Okay. I'm just going to use my finger. Hmm? Can I use my finger? Yeah. Okay. Just very lightly, because it's very pigmented. I <laughs> yeah, I set down. Whoops. I set down a glitter. So okay, that is actually really pretty, right? Yeah, it creates like a nice little bronzy, blushy moment, but it's not too. I feel like it makes it just a little bit light onto my skin. I go into the fifteen N, okay, and I'll grab a glitter. What I like to do is I like to go on obviously the high points of my cheekbones, mm -hmm. but I also like to go and highlight the, the tip of my nose, nose yeah. but I like to create an exclamation point. Yeah, that's what I do. No, yeah. because it make my nose look a little bit more buttony. Is this a cream? It's like a cream to powder type of thing. Okay. okay. So what shade? So I tend to use the gold, the gold mm -hmm. or um, if I'm doing an event, I'll do this one or this one. But for you, I'd probably stick with the gold. The others are a little dark. Though this one might look really pretty with your eye color. 
I'm gonna mix up the dairy. So I'm taking this shade right here, which I forgot to, you know, whatever. They don't want to show up. What the hell? I usually wet them. I wet my brush. Let me just. It's on my finger, okay? I mean, I find that with some Morphe glitters and um, metallics, you need to wet your brush. I'm taking Acorn, which is just like a champagne kind of color, I think. Yeah. It doesn't that really pick it up on camera, but it looks super pretty. You're gonna probably have to go and buy a new one soon. I know, I use it all the time. I like it better once I like hit it with my brush a little bit. I was actually gonna use this as highlight by accident. Hmm? I was gonna use this as highlight by accident. Ooh, that's pretty. It's that's why I like need to buy another one. Yes, you are now on to eyes. You graduated April. Yes. From Jenny's school of makeup. Alright, eyes are done. Close enough. Yep. You're just like nice. Mine's a lot more glittery, but completely up to you. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so I love using type O negative as like a crease color because it's so grayish mm -hmm. on that one right there. Yeah. And I just like to go into my socket and just like blow it all out. Kind of like a dead mm. look. Yeah, pretty powdery. So when do you prime, April? Prime what? Oh, I could use primer. So I'll just, I'll just use primer. I don't do foundation on a week, like weekly basis mm -hmm. I do it for special events so what people see with my skin is what they get mm -hmm. unless someone's getting married someone has died or I just oh, feel like being dying. bougie oh shit <laughs> a little too much on my nose again <laughs> oh, I have free reign now yes um or should I no I think I should, I should instruct <sighs> fine um after, let me see can't see anything. Um, let's go into mix these two shades together. These two? Mix three. Yeah, mix the three of them together. These? Yes. Cake mix, sugar cane, and tongue pop is what she just told me to mix. These three. My nose. Oh, Lord. What? Tongue pop is pigmented. Yep, and you, I was going to say put in the crease, but you did it already, so... I mean, I kind of figured that's where they were going to go. Yep. Now, I do like to spend a lot of time blending out my primer since, A, it helps all my makeup stick. Since I don't wear a foundation. Mm -hmm. Besides setting spray. So after I did that, what else do you do? If you were to prime and put on foundation. Just then, then I start my face. So next I'll do bronzer. I'm gonna be using her Don't Be Afraid to Dazzle bronzer. Now where do you put your bronzer? The same place you do. Okay, so same like three, you do a three or you do the C? Ooh, I do a three because I like to contour my jaw a little bit too. So I'll do here. Ooh, I think I just got pink on my face. <laughs> I did. It's okay. It's okay. So I'll do <laughs> here, then down to here. Okay. And then I get my forehead too, because I have a big forehead. So I don't know what color this is. What is it? Princess Cut or something? Princess Cut is Jeffree Star. Oh, I'm thinking of Princess Avenue or something. Park mm. Avenue Princess. Same shit. Okay, so you put on your cheekbones, kind of like. I put it under my cheekbone. Okay, so she puts it under To create a natural cheek. shadow. Okay, that might be a... Wow. Pink? Yeah. I don't know if there's like a difference or anything. I can't tell. Probably not. I literally feel like that did nothing. What is, a, if you could afford anything, anything, what kind of makeup product would you buy? Oh, eyeshadow, hands down. It's more, it's the most fun. So I'd probably buy like a Pat McGrath palette. Oh, shit. Hmm, 
Okay. Do you know which one specifically you'd buy, or mm. not off the top of your head? Not off the top of my head. That's a good question, though. I think I'd buy a Natasha Denona palette. Yeah, that's fair. Though, to be quite honest, if I had all that money, I would buy a house. I'd pay off my student loans. I do like all the responsible things first. Well, well that's a given. Like, buying I mean, makeup would be, like, bottom priority for me. I mean, that's obviously a given, you know. Okay. What next? Put the red on your lid. Which red, dear? Oh, um... There's, like, three. This might be turned to sabotage. I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to be kind of pissed if you look gorgeous and I look like a clown. <laughs> Put that one on your... Prick? Um, all over your lid. Put prick all over your lid. I had Lucas pick my makeup once. How was that? It turned out really good and he was really upset. Probably a lot better than what this one was. He tried to sabotage, so... Well, I wasn't trying to, but... You're making me put red all over my lid with a pink crease. That's the definition of sabotage, my dear. Oh, Lord. Alright, so here's that. That's done. And this is the best it's gonna get. And then I blush. You blush? I only put blush right here, though. On your cheekbone? Like this part. This isn't really a red, this is more of a pink, oh. if we're being completely honest. So you put it like, put it like right back here? Right here, and back. Got some red on my face. Hey, mm -hmm. blend in. I think if you wanted a red cherry soda would probably have been the way to go, because this actually looks okay. We are somewhat blushed. Then I do my highlight. Is there a specific color that you like to use? I'm guessing the green, right? Yes. <laughs> it looks nice on my skin tone. What kind of skin tone do you have? Like, kind of medium. Medium light. I mean, like, undertone. I'll, I don't know. I don't pay attention to undertones. Someone mowing the grass? Someone mowing the grass, I think. <laughs> Your grass? No. Lovely. <laughs> now you're gonna go and take that color and kind of put candy it, floss and put it in the center of the lid, like a halo eye. Yeah. Can I use my finger? I'll you. Oh, <laughs> raise your big toe. I don't care. All right. Don't do that. I said I could. Okay. Now what do you use after that? A highlight. You didn't highlight. Oh no, I didn't. No, I'm gonna swatch them all because I've never These used These are palette. so soft. And that's why you say you use your finger. Okay. <gasps> what? Ooh, they're a little powdery though. Look at that. Mm -hmm. I mean, they're still stunning. Okay, so this is what the palette looks like. And I'm just gonna go and swatch them all because I'm kind of curious. Which one do you go in with? The green. I feel like this is sabotage. Oh. I really do. Okay. And then let's see how sickly I can look. I'm just gonna take this stupid brush that came with my boxy charm that completely like look at this. This is like sick. Ew! The brush looks look horrible. That's why I might just use it as a highlighter brush. It almost fell. I was like, you started singing now. <laughs> okay. Ooh, I like it. Anything else I need to do? Nope. <laughs> Not my under eye. Why not? Mm. Take some of that deep purple and put it underneath your eye. Honey, which purple? This purple? This purple? The deep one. This one? Yeah. Coma? Okay. And I'm going into the green shade because I really feel like this is going to look ridiculous. But All right. We are golden. It looks like you haven't touched this color. April. Hmm. It looks like you haven't touched this color. I stay away from the design. That's why. Oh. Okay, here we go, into the green. Cute! I can't even see it. Can you? Yeah, it's cute. I know that face. It's cute! It looks good. Do I need an inner corner highlight or are we just, are we done? Actually, yeah, use the highlighter. A oh, butter bronzer? 
Yeah, I usually Okay, am I done with this then? Can I close this? Yes, you can close it. Okay, you're done. I can tell you do it because, uh, when I first got the palette, oops. <laughs> look at how nasty I look. I think you look beautiful. Look at this, like, bronzer moment here. Like, what is, what is that? It's like orange. You knew that coming in, that my bronzer was going to be too dark for you. It's okay, though. So, this is the green highlight, which I'm sure she doesn't really wear. Okay, that saved it a little bit. Right? That's cute. I still don't like it, though. I feel like I need big lashes, like... Redeem yourself? I need lashes, I need liner, I need all of the above. I need the Lord God himself to come down. And It's not like that I didn't do a bad job. It's just like I don't... Those colors don't flatter your skin. They don't flatter my skin tone. Because like if you look in the camera, mm -hmm. I look orange. I look disgusting. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, you kind of look like a corpse that... It kind of makes it look sick actually. I think that's what... My eyes look really green though, but I do. I look sick. You do. That's why I can't pull off vibrant but I pinks. Could. You're just I like, like disgusting. I think I should do your makeup. We can do each other's makeup. How about that? Make That's fine. That's fine. Just please be nice to me. You can do whatever you want to me. All right. All right. Just don't beat up my makeup. That's what I care about. And I'll put the Jeffree Star palette back. Okay. So lipstick color. I tend to do, if I do a bold eye, I do a, a, like a, a neutral lip. If I do a neutral eye, I tend to do a bold lip. Your look today is not as glittery in the eye region as what I usually do, so I'm going to give you a bold lip. Okay. Now, one that I think would look really, really nice on you with this look is this one. I think you have it, though. This is nice to fuchsia. Oh, God, yeah. I'll just use it. Because mine's, mine's all the way over there in the birdcage. I really don't. An orange eye with pink lips. I feel like it looks, like, maybe on me, because on you, this looks super natural. Mm -hmm. But on me, it just, It like, looks, yeah, it looks a little, because I tend to do the warm colors, I think. And you tend to pull cool tone. Mm -hmm. So it does look a little orange on you, but it doesn't look like orange, orange. It's like a little brown red, kind of. Definitely, that makes my eyes look really hazel, though. Mm -hmm. That's why I do like to wear. Mm -hmm. God, that highlight is just like green. That's all I see is freaking green. What am I doing for the lips? Well, when I like to wear bold eyes, I like to do bold, bold lips. lips. Yeah. The same color? <laughs> Honestly, I probably would. All right, all I'd right. Partner it up. Then let me put it on real fast, and then I can't wait to take this off. Oh, that's fine with me. I already know. You really look beautiful. Yeah, okay. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I like it, but just not on your skin tone. And I feel like it kind of, you know what I mean? Like, certain looks, certain people can get, a, can get away with wearing. But. I can't. It's not that I'm not experimental with my makeup. It's like I can't be sometimes. You can't do, like, matchy-matchy with yeah. your lips and eyes i do but really for some reason it look i don't know maybe it's just because i don't really care i'm just like mm -hmm. see normal with me with a orangey eye i like to go with a neutral lip color so i'm not gonna go in like my rebel rose color i usually go <laughs> if i was pale this would look great so should i do that tomorrow with my makeup look yeah you can the eyes look really pretty, but like it just doesn't go. It doesn't skin tone. go, which is sad. I guess that that pal's not for you then. Mm -mm. Hey guys, so this is the finished look for both of us. Yep. I feel like this kind of turned into a little bit of sabotage. Yep. <laughs> I, st I can't take you seriously. I really can't. You but created this. I was so nice, and I made you look bomb. And then I look like a candy floss monster. Well, at least now you know you don't want that palette. It's a really nice palette, I will say, but I couldn't use some of the colors in it, unfortunately. So what did you learn from today, from us doing each other's makeup routine? Um, never to trust you ever again. Um, I learned that you focus a lot more on the skin than I do. I tend to focus more on the eyes, so...
we both have similar routines, just different focuses, I think. Yeah. And I realize that you can't pull off a look like that, because I would. I wouldn't think twice I'd do that. It even makes, like, my dark circles stand out. Gross. But also, we're two completely different skin tones, mm -hmm. so. But for me, I can't wear green highlight. I feel like it just doesn't look right, and I knew you were lying about that. I could tell. No, that's stupid. I have worn it before, though. It's very pretty on my skin tone. Yeah, but on me, it just looks like oh, It mess. looks sickly. Um, I can't use that bronzer as a contour or even as a bronzer because I just see, like, this big orange patch, like, right here, and I'm just, I'm not having it. And the one thing that I notice is that I don't like to pair warm tones with pinks or cool tones, mm -hmm. and that's what I feel like going on. So it's kind of sabotage for me. But, because that's not, I just, I can't. It's just, like, it's bothering me. Like, the orangey of my lid and crease with this, I just, I can't do it. Mm -hmm. All right. So I hope you guys do enjoy this video, and we're going to see each other do each other makeup. Wait. See each other do each other makeup. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We'll see you next time when we do each other's makeup. I don't know your outro, so from me to you, have a great day, and don't look like this.